What's going on YouTube? I'm the Charmawat and welcome to another episode of Top of the Tier, our Pokemon Wi-Fi battling series on PokemonShowdown.com and today you guys, I'm going to be coming to you guys with another UU battle. So if you guys are hyped for another battle, please no offense, leave a like and a comment down below because all of your support is appreciated more than you know. And something very special is going to be happening today you guys, I'm going to be going up against a very good friend of mine, N uh, Morph Nix. I, I nearly just shortened his. Sh um, anyway, we're gonna be uh, we're gonna be battling the North Knicks today. He's a uh, he's a good friend of mine, uh, my my Australian brethren, and uh, he is a very very talented battler, like extremely extremely talented. And uh, I'm a bit a little bit nervous to be going up against him actually, but I'm very excited because I know it's gonna be a great battle. Um, so I am gonna be running the same Yu Gi team that I was using the other day. I uh, feel like I might be able to pull. Pull a win through with this team, m m may maybe. But um, but yeah, I will. <laughs> there he is up, <laughs> up on the screen. But uh, I I will also link his channel uh in the description below because you know you uh he he posts some uh, some cool speed battles as well. And as I said, he's uh he's very very talented in the way he battles. So I uh, I think you guys will enjoy seeing that. So. Without any further ado, you guys, I'm going to uh, cut the video here, and we'll be back in a moment when I have my battle with Nyx. Okay, you guys, so I am back in the battle with Nyx, and uh, I am prepped and ready to go. I am a little bit nervous, like I said, I like I said, but you know, I'm gonna get my head in the game, pretend I'm uh, facing someone else that that isn't quite as good. And uh, and as you can see, we we're uh, we're not using the fifth gen sprites today because uh, someone uh, has a bit of a problem. Anyway, <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm kidding, don't worry guys. Um, so, basically, he's running the Vaporeon, Sceptile, Crobat, Arcanine, Mian Xiao, and Azelf. And that is a really powerful team. He's got some nice, nice defensive bulk there. Like some really nice defensive bulk. But the uh, common weaknesses that I see are not a lot. There's a double rock weakness a uh, double flying weakness, which we might be able to take advantage of. At the moment it's looking like, unless that Azelf setting up rocks, there's not going to be any rocks, which is good because uh, my team really doesn't like rocks. But uh, I, I feel like I want to lead with... I feel like I want to lead with Crobat, just because he gets coverage on so many things. So he leads with Mian Shao. And uh, someone's just... Someone's just joined the uh, the battle, and uh, I have no problem with that. Uh, I also don't have any problem with him leading with Mianxiao, because, as you guys know, Brave Bird, Brave Bird is power. Brave Bird is absolute power. Um, and he hasn't really got any switch-ins for a Brave Bird, so I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna stay in. He goes for the fake out. That's all right. I mean, he had that health back pretty quickly. But I am faster, so I see no reason not to go for the Brave Bird. He does make the switch into Arcanine, which is not Nine Tails, guys. Just, just so you all know, it's not Nine Tails. <laughs> uh, and I think, I think the safest play here is probably to U-turn into Muffins, because Muffins is just going to be able to soak up all of Arcanine's hits. As we get that four percent off, nice and powerful. Nice and powerful. And we can we can eat that fire blast like it is our job. So it looks like it might be a special Arcanine actually. I was expecting physical. But uh but that works too. Special works. Now on the flip side of this, I have no moves to use against Arcanine. And that could be a little bit of a problem. Wasn't really thinking that far ahead. I'm I, I okay, I, I feel like he might switch out this turn. So I'm gonna go for the Bolt Switch. He goes for the Morning Sun. I see you. Well, uh, I've just U-turned then Bolt Switched, which uh, is a, it's an extremely orthodox play, I promise. And there's a guy just driving his motorbike past, out, past my house at the moment, which is a little bit annoying, bro. God, he looks like my age as well. He's not even, not even old enough just casually to be uh, driving along the road. Especially at that speed, damn. Um, okay. Okay, the Earth Power is extremely obvious here. Like, extremely obvious. So I reckon there's a chance he could go into his Azelf. 
or his Crobat. So I'm going to go for the Dark Pulse just to get some... Oh, he doesn't! He doesn't make the play, but he, he gets the flinch. He gets the flinch. Okay, then. So that did, that did 44%. I'm going to be faster no matter what. I am locked into Dark Pulse now, though. What are the chances... What... What are the chances that Dark Pulse can get 50% here? I've got my calcs over here, so... Hi, Dragon. Uh, choice Scarf. And then... Arcanine. I'm going to say UU Defensive, because he took that hit pretty well. Yeah, Dark Pulse really isn't doing... enough to kill... I'm gonna do it anyway. I'm gonna do it anyway. He switches into Crobat. A Crobat. Ah, into a, a, a Crobat. Into Crobat. Okay. I, I can deal with that. I can deal. Because I can make the switch into Muffins. Which is kind of obvious. But it's the best play I have. Because I can't take a U-turn. I know that much. He goes for the Super Fang. Ooh. Ooh, that was a nice play. That was a nice play. Okay. The Arcanine could come back in here, or it could not. I want to say that he's not going to bring it. Actually, you know what? Just in case he does, I'm going to paint. Mm, I, mm, but I can't. I can't paint split in case he stays in here. No, I'm going to paint split. I'm going to paint split. He doesn't switch out. That's a bit annoying. I must say, that's, that's a touch annoying. Okay, then. I might have to Volt Switch. Which I don't want to do. But I think I'm going to have to. I think I'm going to have to Volt Switch. He goes for the Brave Bird, which I resist. Okay. Okay, I can Volt Switch. Oh, it kills him. Damn. I honestly thought he could have lived that. I honestly thought he could have. Okay, I feel like now is a really good time to bring in Beedrill. Like, a really good time. Because I've got the free switch in. So. I think, I think it's, I think it's a good time. So, he's got the Azelf as well, which is a bit, a bit annoying, so I'm going to have to protect, I'm going to have to Mega Protect, because obviously there's, there's not much else I can do. He's going to probably set up, mm, he set up rocks. I couldn't risk that though, I couldn't risk the Psychic, in my defense. So really, I can go for the U-Turn or the Poison Jab, because they're both going to do a butt ton. I think I'm going to go for the U-Turn though. Yeah, he's got the sash as well, but uh, I had to, uh, yeah, I had to get out in case he lived it, I suppose. And then I might just go into muffins, and if muffins has to get sacked off here, then so be it. Yeah, that gets rid of that. That gets rid of that threat. And now, 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 I could bring you B drill again. I could bring in Beedrill and just take the, the revenge kill. But what I think I'm going to do instead is bring in Burt. Because if I have Burt in, I can potentially get the, um, the Defog off next turn. If I go for a Brave Burt now. Okay, okay. All I can say is Nyx is playing very differently and a lot better to the uh, the low ladder opponents I was I was put up against in matchmaking when I was prepping. <laughs> Damn. Okay. We get it, you vape. <laughs> okay, 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 Nyx, we get it, you vape. Um. Mmm. The ice beam. Can I take an ice beam? I don't think I can, but I am specially defensive. I am specially defensive, so... Let me see. Against a Vaporeon. Um, gotta put the moves in. Ice Beam, how much is Ice Beam doing? 
Ice Beam's only doing about, like, 50%. And Brave, Brave Bird's doing about 30. But that means that I can go for the Defog this turn, get rid of the rocks, and then have some damage off with a U-turn. Yep, I'm going to do it. Defog. Let's go. Okay, Skull's doing 31, but I get the burn! Mm. Oh, it's annoying. That's really annoying. Because Crobat is pretty much useless now. All those revenge kills we could have got. Damn. Okay. Heliolisk coming in. Heliolisk is coming in. The Scald, I get the dry skin immunity. That's perfect. Okay. I'm life orbed. Right. I am life orbed. The Thunderbolt is obvious. But Nyx isn't doing a lot of switching in this game. He's, he's not. So I reckon I reckon because I've been making so many predictions, he's gonna predict me to predict him. And this is really dumb, but I'm gonna go for the Thunderbolt. He protects. Okay. Okay, I see you. I see you. I'm gonna Thunderbolt again. I'm gonna do it. I'm real. Cause he's he's wondering right now if I'm gonna predict him to predict me to predict him. And and it's gonna be predictions. It's gonna be predictions inside of predictions. And he Damn, he's not real. He's not real. He's not real. Okay. In an ideal world, I would really like to bring in Beedrill. Because I'm assuming this could be Mega. I'm assuming this is going to be Mega. Like, like, really sure. Hmm... No, I don't want to keep it in. I don't want to keep it in. I'm going to Burt, sack it off, and get Beedrill in. That's what I'm going to do. Focus Blast, he misses the Focus Blast. It's not really going to matter either way. Beedrill... Beedrill will speed tie with this thing. Oh, that's not good. That's really not good. I'm guessing that's Hidden Power Ice, too. Oh, please, God. Okay, I have to win the speed tie. I, I might be able to take one... I, I don't even think I can take one hit. Let's be honest, speed drill is frail as hell. He switches! Ooh! Ooh! Nyx! Guess the crit, though. I'm guessing he's not max speed. I really want to say that his Sceptile is not max speed. And I do not want to take a fake out. So I'm going to protect. Okay. Now that that's out of the way, I can safely go for a U-turn. Get up out. Mian Xiao wrecks my team, though. Mian Xiao destroys my team. Does a poison jab kill a Mian Xiao? Poison jab kills. Damn. Okay. Oh wait, but I'm at minus attack. Oh, thank God he switched out there. Thank God he did. Damn. Okay. I was not thinking about that. Okay, you turn. Let's do it. Kind of wish I didn't do that, but oh well. Oh well. Let's go. Let's go into this. I can take a hit. I can take a hit and then I'm faster. So he's gonna go for the fake out. He's not going for the fake out! Damn! I was just ready to take a fake out there. Okay then. I'm lucky he didn't switch into Sceptile. God damn. Okay. I think I can take a hit. I think I can take a hit from Sceptile. I'm not going to calc it, because if I don't live it, it doesn't matter, but I'm going to go for the Hyper Voice. Oh, I forgot about Focus Blast. 
Okay, so pretty much Beedrill has to come through. Otherwise, I can't win. If Beedrill comes through, I can win. It's a poison jab. Let's do it. Be real, Nyx. Did you run max speed on your Sceptile? He didn't run max speed. I'm sure he did not run max speed now. Okay. I think that might be GG. He's going for the Protect. I really don't think he ran max speed. Don't burn me. Far out! No! <laughs> oh, no! Oh! Nyx, you crafty... Sorry about that, there was a, uh, a little family interruption there. Oh my god, oh sweet lord. Let's kill it with the U-turn. Mm-hmm, <laughs> trying for the double protect, I see you. I see you, son. He's gonna be faster than Hydreigon. And he's gonna focus blast me, which will probably knock me out. I think that burn just won Nyx the match, which is really depressing. He didn't run max speed. Oh! Oh! We still beat him! We still hit him! Oh, oh my god, I didn't think I'd be able to get the 66%! I really thought that burn was gonna matter! Oh my god! GG! Well then, well then, oh, he just admitted he had three moves on Sceptile. <laughs> oh, GG. Well, if <sighs> that was a pretty crazy battle, I did not expect it to turn out like that. That's a nice clean 2 0. Damn. Nyx has got those skills. Oh, well, yeah, some key points of that battle were definitely, uh, Definitely, definitely, definitely. I don't, oh my god. I can't even, I, I need to actually just scroll back to actually to even remember what some key points were, because I'm overwhelmed. Just just some of the, the the nice plays we made, the safe plays. Nick's made some brilliant plays. Nick's probably made some better plays than I did. But, uh, but yeah, Beedrill just came through. Damn, okay. Well then, if you guys have enjoyed this battle, please not forget to leave a like and a comment down below because all of your support is appreciated more than you know. I really, really do appreciate all the support you guys give me because it's, uh, it, it, it's really nice. So, uh, thank you. Thank you. But, um, and uh, please also go check out Nyx as well. Uh, as I said, his channel will be linked in the description below. B uh, below? But, um, but yeah, until next time, you guys, I'm the Charmwort, and I'll see you then. Bye!